Coding is the act of creating a set of instructions that can control a computer and tell it what to do. So let's break this down a little bit. Computers are simply physical devices. They are very complex machines, but they're just machines. Without being told what to do, they'll just sit there. The way a computer works is this. Inside that computer is a tiny, tiny device. It's called a central processing unit. Now, that sounds all fancy. It's just the brains of the outfit. And this is the traffic cop behind how a computer does everything it does. It's helpful when looking at this to understand the basic purpose of a computer. The purpose of the computer is to take data in, work with that data in some manner, and send that data on to another device, say another computer or a display. So the computer takes in data, works with it, and sends it on. And this CPU, or central processing unit, that's what does that actual work. It can actually receive data from another computer. It can do things with that data, like mathematical operations or text operations, that sort of thing. It can prepare images to be displayed on a screen. It can do a lot of different things. When it's done doing that work, it sends that data that is worked on to the device that needs to receive it. So what does this have to do with coding? Well, here's the thing. Unless you tell the computer exactly what to do, one step at a time, it won't do anything. So all these programs that you're used to using, let's say, you know, word processing programs like Microsoft Word or computer games you might play, right? Every single one of them, if you were to look under the hood inside them, you'd find they were composed of a huge collection of instructions that that computer can understand. These instructions might relate to things like taking data from an input device, like, you know, a touch screen or a mouse or a game controller. Or the instructions might relate to doing something with data, like getting an image ready to present to be shown on a display screen. There are many, many things that a computer can do. But the basic thing to know is it can only do one thing at a time, and it has to be told what to do. So this is what coding is. It's being the person who actually tells the computer what to do. It's the person who comes up with an idea and says, well, I want a, a, a computer program that will act as a recipe book. I want to be able to store recipes and then search for specific recipes later on. And I want the recipes to be able to display on the screen and have it so where when you're done doing one step, it'll show that that step is in green and has been done or something of this sort. So you can learn how to do that. That's called coding. You can learn the specific instructions that you can enter into a computer to make it do things like display data on the screen, accept data from a user, change the way data looks on the screen, all these things. So that's coding.